Hey guys, welcome to a Tilly's Market Walkthrough. Uh, so today I will show you how to buy a digital option on Tilly's DAP. Um, so we land on the landing page, I open the DAP, and I can come ahead and connect my wallet to the DAP. Once my wallet is connected, I can go ahead and select the type of option I want to buy. Uh, so today we'll be buying digital options with Tilly's Market. Um, it's pretty simple the way it works. So we can choose an asset, we choose a maturity date, we choose a direction. We got four different options here, uh, up, down, in, or out. Um, I'll go in details about the, each one of them in a second here. And then uh, we enter the price uh, that we're ready to pay. Um, so for today, uh, let's look at the assets that we can choose from. So depending on the chain you're on, obviously, I'm on Optimism right now, different chain of different assets. Uh, but let's just stick for uh, on Optimism. So I'll choose Bitcoin for today. And then we can choose our maturity date, which I'll choose a later expiry. So end of the month expiry on the 27th of October. Um, and then here we go, we can choose our uh, direction. Um, so obviously the uh, position that are less risky um, are almost secured, right? So 24, uh, 500, the, the odds that it ends up, uh, that the price on the 27th ends up closing above uh, 245 $24,500 um, is pretty high, therefore the the option is price high. Um, and then if we go all the way here at $31,000, uh, the option is less expensive as, um, well, there's less chance it happens. Um, and then it's the same uh, way for down market. So if you're uh, on a bearish mood, um, so if we think it's going to close below 27K at the, on the 27th of October, uh, here we have the price of the option. And here you can see the, the ROI on each of those uh, positions if L until maturity. Uh, so up if you're bullish, right? So the price has to be above that strike price on a maturity date. Uh, down if you're bearish. So the price has to be below the strike price on the maturity date uh, for it to resolve in the money. And um, we also have in and out market. So in and out works a bit differently. It's basically a built-in strategy for you guys, um, basically short or long volatility. So if I think that the option uh, Bitcoin is going to close um, between one of these price um, offered here uh, by the end of the maturity date, then uh, I can buy something. So let's say I think it's going to stick within that range. Uh, so it's the cost 38 cents. Uh, so if the price is below 28, 500 and above 26, 500 on the 27th of October, then I am in the money. Uh, if I'm above or below them, I'm out of the money and uh, both options. So it's basically combining up and, uh, and down markets together, right? But we're doing it for you. Um, here it's the same principle, but out. So if we think that the price will go uh, outside uh, a range, right? So if we think it's going to go um, above 28,500 uh, or below 27,500, then this is an option we can buy here. Um, and just for this example today, we'll just buy an up market and you guys will see how it works. Um, so I'll be able to bullish with you guys today. So I'm going to expect to close above 29,000 for the end of the, the month uh, by the 27th. So what that means, that means that my position costs 31 cents. Um, and if it close in the money, that 31 cents is going to turn into a dollar. Um, so you're buying one option at 31 cents. And if you close it in the money, you'll be able to redeem one option for $1. And if it does close out of the money, then your um, position resolves out of the money and you basically lose your 31 cents. Uh, so let's just buy uh, some with you today. Uh, so I'll buy a few options. Um, yeah, so let's check. Uh, let's just buy like $5. This should give me a few position here. Um, yeah, so we can see if the price is above 29K on October 27th. I will win uh, 1582. Uh, so basically, uh, 3x on my money, which makes sense since it's 31 cents, right? Uh, so I can go ahead and buy that.
And once the transaction here is processed, it will appear in my position uh, below right here. Um, yeah, and then we'll be able to see it on chain as well. Um, you can always track your position looking at your profile as well right here. Um, yeah, um, that's it. That's how you buy a digital option on Tally's markets. Um, if you have any questions, head on to the Discord and we'll be happy to help you. Have a good day.